Hey everyone, so text to 3D is taking off in a pretty big way. And today I've got a couple of new tools for you to check out, some of which are in the beta phase, but a few you can actually play with right now. Okay, let's hop in. So kicking off with Motion GPT, which is text generated character animations. This one comes to us from Deep Motion and is currently in beta. As you can see, we prompt an action and then our character begins taking that action. Uh, there's a couple of other examples here. Um, there's a ninja, which is awesome, and a giant Kong character. Now, one thing to note, as the name implies, uh, this is just generating character motion. This is not generating like the full 3D scene. Although here are some examples of some finalized projects. You can export your animations under the typical file formats, FBX, GLB. As I mentioned, Motion GPT is in beta and it's going to be there for a while. It's actually not set to release until winter of 2024. So if you're interested, definitely sign up for the beta. And while you're there, you might want to check out Animate 3D, which is available now and is free. Animate 3D is pretty interesting in that you can take any video, feed it in and get a 3D model. So I took this stock video, fed it into Animate 3D and we got this. And as you can see, we now have a full 3D character uh, from that video source. Um, there is like, you can see here, her head isn't quite uh, in the right place. Uh, what's kind of neat is that there is this rotoscope pose editor up here as well. So I didn't get a chance to play around with this too much, but it does look like if you are pretty good with rigging, uh, you can go through and make manual changes. You can even go into a 3D view with the pose editor. That's pretty crazy for something that's web-based. Again, the link to Animate 3D is down below and it is free. Next up, Luma Labs have released Genie, which is a free, for now at least, uh, text to 3D model generator. So currently you generate 3D models in Genie via Discord. Now like half of you are like groaning right now, but come on, it's free. Uh, you just head over to one of the Genie channels and type in a prompt and you get something pretty quickly. Uh, someone here typed in otter character, cute T-pose, and we got an otter character, not quite in a T-pose, but you know, it's an otter. They don't listen to directions. They're cute, they just don't listen to directions. Uh, you can choose any one of these. Let's take this, uh, let's take the third one here. Um, and that prompts you out to a website. Uh, and from here, you pretty much have your 3D model. I didn't notice that you can actually just go back and forth between the other four down here as well. From there, just hit the download button. It kicks out as a GIB file. And just to show you that T-posing does work, uh, somebody generated up Mario in a T-pose. Yeah, this is a really good model uh, and does indeed prove that Italian plumbers follow directions better than otters. But if you're underwhelmed with the overall look of the meshes coming out of Genie, uh, Dawid Rish, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, said that they're not production ready, but do make for great placeholders. And after about an hour and a half of generative and rendering time, he ended up with this. And this looks pretty stunning, but you can also take the out of the box assets and have some fun with those too. As Coffee Vectors did by taking those genie assets, loading them into a Unity template and then exploring that space with a Quest 3. As I always like to mention, if this looks a little janky to you, this is the worst it is ever going to look. Moving on, Stability AI have announced Stable 3D, which is their text to 3D model generator. This one is in private preview. You can request access by using the link below. Not much to see yet. They did provide what I presume to be a simulation of my kids cleaning up those stupid blind bag figures off the floor that I constantly step on. Look, I can't get too mad. They were Legos back in my day that my dad stepped on. Stability's goal here is to level the playing field for independent designers, artists, and developers, enabling them to create thousands of 3D objects per day at very little cost. Stable 3D will output in the OBJ format. There is no date on release yet. Swapping over to a tool that you can use right now, we have Motion, which is just a ton of fun to say. Uh, Motion is text to character animation, and you can use it right now, and it is free. Motion is a lot of fun, although the caveat that like all early AI stuff, it's gonna take you a number of generations if you are looking to get something very specific. For example, uh, somebody prompted landing on Mars. The left side actually does kind of look like you know, someone jumping off of a spaceship onto the surface of Mars. The right side kind of looks like me at that St. Patrick's Day party 10 years ago. My to-do list is getting out of control. So I wanted to do some smaller videos instead of like one massively long 40 minute video that no one has time to watch anyways. So if you haven't had a chance, please do hit the subscribe button because there's a lot more of this coming. I thank you for watching. My name is Tim.